have 10, 10 a.m. here on the West Coast, and I uh, hope everyone's had a great day so far. Really appreciate you logging in, and uh, look forward to spreading some wealth of information on our multi-life platform. Uh, our guaranteed issue DI has really been the top seller for the year, uh, and that's been trending for the last few years now, but really kicking on. Uh, it's been the go-to to process our high-limit DI product, and uh, we'll go over those exact reasons why here in today's webinar. We'll try and keep it as quick and concise as possible, and I'm going to try and open it up to any questions here at the end, so make sure you stay around for the live discussion, or feel free to send us an email. Uh, my email personally is robert at piu.org, or the general email box piu at piu.org. So thanks again for logging in. And uh, to get us started, you know, really just start on a broad sense, the importance of disability protection. I know we are all advocates of it. There's some producers out there only selling life, only selling health. The truth is disability insurance matters. Protecting your paycheck is the most important thing that you can do for your clients. They would be surprised to know that only 10% of disability claims are caused by accidents. That's leaving 90% for illness, medical concerns, cancer, diabetes, things that we think we're invincible of and will never really affect us. Truth is, one in four adults will become disabled during their working career. I think that stat's even growing a little bit higher than what we're used to, uh, even down to one in three. So disabilities are happening. People have stories. Make sure you're bringing this up to them. The average claim length for those disabilities is just over two years. Some do have lifetime disabilities, others with just one year. But again, we're seeing the most common period at just over two. And that's leaving 12% of the American population uh, currently facing disabilities. That represents about 37 to 38 million people just here in the US. So an astonishing number and definitely an important discussion to have with your clients. And the often confusing fact is that when people work with a high income earner, say earning 500,000 or one number. The key here is that we cannot discriminate against the high income earners. If we picture the house that the person earning $100,000 per year lives in, it's probably quite a bit smaller and much different than the million dollar earner. They're probably learn living in a much larger estate, nicer cars, more cars. Everything just adds up to that high net worth lifestyle. So we have to address these needs. They're still spending the same proportion of money, and that's why high limit DI becomes very involved for these high, in, high income earners. Most likely what we see when we're talking about clients DI is they have a group LTD product in force. When you're bringing up the DI discussion, they say, yeah, I have DI, it's through my employer. And the first thing that we want to uncover is how much would that DI product pay you if you became disabled? Oftentimes, it's not enough. It's a 60% benefit, then it's taxable. We're really looking at 40% replacement of income. So for those earning a little bit more and needing maybe a, a smaller uh, gap protection or buy-up, they have an IDI plan. This serves an additional layer of DI, but then we still have the top tier, the executives, the business owners, the CFOs. These individuals are earning even greater paychecks and have an even bigger potential for a disability income gap. And so for that, we use Peterson International DI products to address the high income earners and their large DI needs. 
we've identified what we call the $250,000 trigger. That means any of your clients earning at least $250,000 and above will definitely need a third tier of DI, or third layer as we like to call it. And some, as we go up the income, uh, income scheme, will even need a fourth layer. So that's what we're here to address. That's how our product fits into the access market. And we have a guaranteed standard issue product that addresses these third and fourth layers, which we'll talk about today. This really comes from three different areas. We have employee benefits advisors who are selling the GSI product. We have independent agents who are able to talk with their individual client and spread it into a GSI opportunity with a group. And then we also have the business advisors who are doing a lot of the business planning and can also use GSI to fulfill those needs. From the employee benefits aspect, we're really looking to address the reverse discrimination against those high income earners. So how are we ensuring that when we say we provide DI benefits to all of our employees, that we're really providing 60% no matter these individuals' income. Because at the end of the day, those executives are the ones really making the greatest impact for the company as far as a grand scheme. And so we want to help our client, being the company, find those key executives and retain those key executives give them benefits that make them want to stay with our organization. How we approach this is when you're an employee benefits advisor, the census that you're working on, we're going to apply the $250,000 trigger. We're identifying anyone making greater than $250,000 per year because that is our greatest chance of needing a third tier of coverage and possibly fourth down the road. For the individual clients, the successful discussion has been to bring up everything that individual contract is going to require. So we have things like a, an extensive application. We need full medical underwriting, which includes pyramid, blood, urine, financial underwriting. And then after that, there's the possibility that your client might have warranties that they need to sign or even worse, full policy exclusions for maybe some health issues from the past. These things can be red flags to the individual clients. How we address this is that, you know what, your client making a decent or high income earning income probably has colleagues in a similar position, right? They have similar group benefits and most likely they're going to have similar incomes. So we raise the question, Mr. Client, if I said we can avoid these medical exams, save you about 20% on your premium, would you be interested in something like that? Don't you think John, Billy, and Amanda down the hall might be in a similar situation? Would you be willing to offer me and a referral to any of those individuals to just see if we can make this happen for you because I care for your best interest. Let's make this easy on you. That's been the most successful way that we can approach GSI through an individual client. Lastly, for business advisors, might not be known, but our guaranteed issue product is offering GSI on buy sell key person, business overhead expense, loan, and even severance contracts. There's a lot we can do in the business planning world. It makes it extremely easy when there's at least three partners in the business and they're looking for some DI solutions. So exactly what is consisted of our guaranteed standard issue product? First off, we need a minimum of three people. That's a very low number. We've made this product extremely versatile to get into the hands of your clients. Obviously, no exams, no underwriting whatsoever, and the premiums discounted. Those first three bullet points should be enough to want to go GSI. 
to make it even better, these policies are being issued quicker than ever, it's still a portable IDI contract. So if an executive leaves the company, they can take this coverage with them as an IDI policy. That's also a great opportunity for you to expand the outreach of your GSI to the new company they might be working with. Uh, lastly, an automatic benefit increase rider is included for all individuals on the GSI platform, which allows their income to be fulfilled with a DI need as they receive raises over the years. The key benefits for you to offer GSI is because it's extremely simple to process. Your case, manage, your case management team will love you first off. There, again, no underwriting whatsoever. We take one page in to issue the policy, which we'll have more details later on in the webinar. And they're being issued extremely quick. It makes you look like a hero at the end of the day when you can return to your client within one or two weeks with that full DI policy that they'd purchased. Our GSI has been a very great form of steady business, so we're seeing that not only are policies staying on the books after the five-year renewal periods, but that enrollment is actually growing at each renewal pr period, which is a great benefit to you and greater commissions, of course. In the background, the multi-life features for your client are a five-year policy term. It's offering an own occupation definition, and we're doing this using monthly or monthly and lump sum benefits. So we can either do the combination or even a 10-year monthly benefit period. The multi-life has a 312 pre-ex. This will take anything in the last three months from the inception date, any medical history or issues would be excluded for the first year. However, after that first year of coverage, your client now has full protection for their disability protection. No exclusions, no pre-ex applied, absolute full coverage they can claim for any reason. An interesting note, and why we call this the retro pre-ex, is that that one pre-existing period, the first year of the first policy, is the only time a pre-ex is applied. So at the five-year renewal for the following term, there is no new pre-ex. It is still the original first year 312 pre-ex. So your client is able to renew the coverage. It's not taking into consideration any new medicals. Um, any updates or recent doctor visits, that all just goes through with full coverage. The automatic benefit increase rider, like we already mentioned, and the additional riders available to the clients are residual and cost of living adjustment. So we can structure the GSI product in three different ways, which really allows us to create opportunities for a number of different uh, possibilities. It's either a mandatory, hybrid, or voluntary offering. And each has their own benefit and really key guidelines of which is better to use. Now, let me just put a disclaimer out. Between these three options, we usually help a lot here in our back office. What we want from the agent or advisor is simply the census. If we can help you identify the opportunities and including with that would be the right approach. So if you send us the census, we're going to see, you know what, this group is 500 plus, we're going voluntary all the way, this is the best chance of making it a success, or for many attorney firms, 20 to 30 employees, we've seen the hybrid model uh, work extremely well. To give you a brief rundown of the positives and negatives of each, the mandatory is really the most common in business planning needs. So when we have at least 
three partners or sometimes five or six partners in a business, we know that all of them are going to want a DI policy for that buy-sell contract. So that's an obvious mandatory situation. You'll see that the mandatory is the product that goes down to three lives. So when we have small businesses or maybe smaller executive carve-outs, the mandatory is going to be the best option. It also offers the lowest premiums and ideal if the company is looking to add this as merely an employee benefit for their executives because they will be the payer of the policy and therefore can assure any executives that may come in the future that this is a benefit that they can say they're providing. On the voluntary side, we're really only looking at large groups. Voluntary, as you might know with other experiences, is very hard to make a push uh, and a strong participation on. It takes a lot of employee education, um, a lot of work on the agent's behalf to make that happen. So with voluntary, we need at least 10 lives that we can look at. We would need at least 50% participation on. Again, ideal for associations uh, where we have hundreds of eligible participants and we're simply making this available as a benefit to those individuals. Something new and, and very easy to help with the voluntary process is our online enrollment. So when we have voluntary, we're going to need acknowledgement from each individual. And instead of getting paper apps to each person, the online enrollment, sending a link in a company email blast has been a great way to fulfill this need and make it easier for the clients to obtain. The hybrid option has probably been the most popular GSI option to date. What we're doing with the hybrid is when we have a company with at least 10 people included, we're going to have a portion of employer paid DI and then offer a buy up that would be employee paid. So step one, we're getting the company to offer at least an additional $10,000 per month to all of their individual employees. Again, at least 10 people and at least $10,000 per month. If we have step one completed, then we can offer anyone who would be eligible for more coverage a buy-up to buy any additional amount of coverage they would like without any participation requirements. So when we offer the buy-up, if only one executive out of 5, 10, or 20 people wanted to buy up coverage to their full DI benefit, that would go through guaranteed issue. Really a versatile product. It allows the employer to get in and offer their executives a key benefit without breaking the bank. Then it's up to the employee to purchase however much coverage they feel is necessary. So a really versatile product. Again, when the census comes back to us for certain groups, we really help identify the right way that we can apply the GSI product. And hybrid is often one of those options, and we help a lot in the employee education. What we need in order to process this are four pieces of information on a census. That's the date of birth, the income, occupation, and current DI coverage in force for the clients. Now we can have first name, last name, many other fields that we can include. Uh, however, just to quote, we need these four items. We do have a template available of our preferred census, so if we can provide you with that after the webinar, please send us an email. Initiation of the plan is probably the best part about GSI. The form on the left with the green heading, that's the only piece of paper that we need to process a mandatory GSI plan. Whether there's three, 
10 or 100 people on that guaranteed issue policy, that one piece of paper on the left there is all we absolutely need. When we switch over to a voluntary, the paper on the right with the blue, with the blue heading, excuse me, is what we would need from each eligible individual. That piece of paper is giving them six different options of how they could structure their DI benefits or an option to decline. We simply need their signature and date at the bottom. And don't forget the voluntary online uh, enrollment link, which we can also send to fulfill that need. So GSI has really been the best way to offer DI. If you're not looking to expand your commissions to make it easier on your clients, GSI has been the way to do it. Our most common rebuttals as advisors are that the product's too expensive, there's too much paperwork, questions, don't want to go through exams. GSI really addresses each of these rebuttals, right? We're discounting the premium. We only need one piece of paper for, from you, which only includes a signature. No questions, no exams. I'm going to get this policy back to you in a week. That's the best way to sell DI. And it's the most profitable to you as well. When you're selling Peterson GSI, we do not grade the commission, no matter how many people are on the census, how high the premium gets. These, this earning potential for you is exponential. Really a great time, a great way to get DI into your client's hands and certainly the most profitable for you as the agent. To wrap up here, we're offering GSI again personal needs, stock option income protection, pilots loss of license, uh, or 401k completion, so if you're for the retirement needs. On the business side, any company with at least three partners, you should know guaranteed issue is the way to go. For a buy-sell, a key person, if you have a group of doctors, a group of private physicians, BOE, on a guaranteed issue is extremely easy to initiate. Also taking care of loans and severance agreements. So GSI has really been a very versatile product to be used across the DI market, whether it's personal, business. Um, it's rewarding for you. It makes it extremely easy on the client and it should be more than evident why this has been such a successful product for us. And if you have any questions that we can help with, maybe a particular group, or you're looking to reach out to certain groups about this excess need, we're happy to help. So give us a call, 800-345-8816. We also have more information on our website, www.piu.org. Feel free to email me directly as well, as well robert at piu.org. So I really appreciate you attending today. Again, if we can be of any assistance, please let us know, and uh, we'll hope to hear from you soon.